All right, guys, I'm showing you a little shabby yard today. I uh, didn't cut you last week. It, had, it was dry all week. But this is uh, 1st of June. This is what my fescue is looking like. This time last year, we was already brown in a lot of areas down here because we had a lot of heat. I sprayed now twice. Uh, I don't think the first time I fertilized uh, I don't think I sprayed. I don't, I don't think that I mixed up anything for my the trimec. I don't think I mixed anything up for clover because I had clover everywhere. So then I go, okay, well, I need to mix it up again. Well, I'm sitting there and I'm thinking, all right, once all that clover is gone, I'll be good to go. And then right there. So apparently I got all of it down through there and somehow... I missed this whole big patch right here. And you can tell as it goes along like this line that that's where I missed. And I must have came from here over and somehow missed that whole big spot. So I had to spray that the other day. And then up here, it was the same way, but there was it wasn't as big as a, a patch. So... As you come this way, you see there and there. So apparently I missed that when I was spraying. Uh, nothing like having thatch in the yard. And then apparently I made a few turns and missed another little bit of a row. Nothing that you can't fix. I mean, I show you the difference in my backyard and my front yard and I'm going to fix this this year but this is my front yard you know I have a few places that I miss no big deal but this is the backyard I don't do anything back here except mow it spray around the fire pit and I mean that's it so uh, tons of bees out here all the time my kids like to run around barefooted so it, it, I'm going to be spraying this out to get rid of it. I mean, you can see this is the side of the yard that I treat. This is my tall fescue. This is the white clover and junk. I kind of cut it off right there at the uh, porch or the deck. And then everything back through here is just whatever grows and it wants to grow. So, uh, uh, but I am going to get rid of this white clover. One, I don't want to bring it up to the front yard. And two, I think it'll be better for my kids not getting stung. So I actually did spray. I had, I'd only mixed up about a half a gallon and I had a little bit. So I sprayed here and here. But yeah, I just want to show you guys, which I'm going to get a different tip. I use a shower head tip when I'm, you know, spraying. And I don't think that's the best for like a blanket spray. A blanket spray, it should be just an even mist all over. But just wanted to just wanted to show you guys. I mean, I'm human. I make mistakes, and here I am sitting here thinking that I was fixing to get all these weeds gone, and lo and behold, I missed a whole strip. Apparently, I got it here because I had some there. But it's like I just came up through here and I was like, nah, let's just go this way. And so I went up through there. So this whole strip from here to there didn't get it. So guys, I'm human. If you uh, you got some white clover, because I was, I was really under the impression that the Trimec didn't work because I've always used Speed Zone and had good results. And then I started using this this year, but just because I ordered it from Pete on GCI Turf Academy, because I was already ordering fertilizer, same price, free shipping. So in the speed zone, I could only get like in a, a gallon jug and I don't need that much. So uh, I was about to say the stuff didn't work and then realized that I must just not have put any in the first time I fertilized. And so then I came back a second time and sprayed and knocked out. I had a bunch of clover in through there, white clover here and here and here. And then just a few weeks ago, I, I said, man, I, I got to hit that again and missed that spot there. So uh, maybe I wasn't paying attention. Who knows? But anyway, uh, just want to show you guys. It's, it's an easy fix. You just 
take your measurements on your half I measured up half a gallon and uh, use half of the thousand square foot is like a half ounce and just sprayed all that went through the yard spot spraying any places that I missed before the heat gets here like I said you know this is the first of June and normally this time of year we are going dead and I'm still green we got weather really good we got a lot of rain today is a uh, Tuesday we got rain Sunday and Monday a lot of it and we needed it because uh, I, I was starting to have a little brown issue but I'm gonna put some propaganda saw out here and some iron down in a few weeks and roll into the summertime and uh, I'll check back with you then we'll see you next time